Hi, I'm Anna Thompson from the Tactics and the Silver Ferns, and it's a little bit chilly here in Christchurch today, but we're about to bust in on Georgia and her friend Nicole. Now I'm going to take them through some skills and drills. Let's go see if they're home. Hi girls! Hello! Hello. How are you going? Great, Hello. thanks. It's good. I'm Anna and I'm pretty excited to be here today because I'm going to take you through some skills and drills. Awesome! Ooh. Do you want to show me around? Yeah, yeah sure. Come out the back. Awesome. The first one we're going to work on is our footwork. So footwork is such an important part of the game. So our first one is just over and back over the line, okay? So it's getting our feet nice and fast. And these kind of drills you can do for a warm-up. So let's do this first one. So we're going over and back of the line. Okay, and if we can, keeping our heads up, okay? So let's do that for five seconds. Ready? Go. Two, three, four, five. Excellent. That's really good. Okay, so the next one we're going to do is a grapevine. We start here, grapevine, and then back again. Okay, your turn. Great. Very good. Okay, now last one, which is another great one you can include in your warm up, is just change of direction because we do a lot of that on the netball court. Okay, so three, change direction, change direction, change direction. Okay, where you go. Good. Excellent. So now we're going to work on our passing. Okay, so we've got so many different types of passes that we can use. We've got our chest pass, we've got our overhead pass, we've got our bounce pass, and we've got our shoulder pass as well. Okay, so I reckon you guys could show me how it's done. Show me how to do a chest pass. Good, so when we're doing our chest pass, we want to make sure that we've got a W, okay? We're stepping into it to get that power behind it. And if you're receiving the pass, you've got that target up ready to catch that ball. Great girls, and now let's see how we go at the overhead pass, okay? So the ball's coming from above our head. Yeah, again, we can really step into it to get that power behind it. And our receiver needs to show us a target as to where to pass the ball. So our next pass is the bounce pass, which is a great option to have. Bounce pass needs to be to hit the ground three quarters of the way between you and your partner, okay? So just past halfway, okay? So it needs to bounce up and land at their chest as well. We don't want anything landing down at their knees or at their feet. Right girls, it's time to move on to our last pass and this is a shoulder pass. So we kind of want to angle our body a little bit. That's it. So we can still get that power from the shoulder and we're really pushing the ball nice and strong with our feet moving forward and our hips coming through as well. So let's just quickly go over those things that we learned. So footwork, remember it's such a key element of our game. And the other thing, passing. So passing, we've got lots of different options that we can use at any time in the game. Just, just about reading our defence and seeing what they're doing. Did you have fun today? Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. Thanks, Anna. You're welcome. Right, should we go inside and warm up? Yeah. Radio, let's go. Okay. 